Good evening, Matt Wordsworth with ABC News. The ABC's chairman is resisting growing calls for his resignation over claims he tried to compromise the public broadcaster's independence. Justin Milne has been accused of urging the former managing director, Michelle Guthrie, to sack a senior reporter after a backlash from the coalition government. It sparked outrage among staff who are demanding he stands aside. Late this afternoon, the government called an inquiry. We'll have more on that in a moment. But first, this report from Jade McMillan. The chaos at the top brought ABC staff together, demanding the chairman steps down. If he cannot act in the best interests of an independent ABC, then he simply must resign. <laughs> The union called snap meetings across the country, worried that the ABC's independence had been compromised. Hands off ABC! Hands off ABC! One former chairman, who has also served as managing director, says a line has been crossed. That's all spelled out clearly in the ABC Act. It is not the chairman's role and it's not the board's role uh, to make decisions on who should be uh, working in the ABC. And if that report is accurate, uh, his position is untenable. And I'm t talking just about the email alone. Justin Milne hasn't formally responded to claims he told the recently sacked MD Michelle Guthrie to fire Chief Economics Correspondent oh, Emma Alberici after her reporting on the government's innovation spending was criticised by then Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull. Excerpts of emails published by Fairfax Media claim Mr Milne wrote to Ms Guthrie saying they hate her. We are tarred with her brush. I think it's simple. Get rid of her. We need to save the ABC, not Emma. It's disappointing if it's true, obviously. You don't want your chairman to hold such a dim view of you and your journalism. Justin Milne was appointed by Malcolm Turnbull last year. He's a friend and former business partner of the former Prime Minister at the internet company Aussie Mail. He's also on the board of NBN. The ABC is funded by the taxpayer. It's governed by an independent board and uh, its independence is important to me. Uh, it's important, important to our government and that independence uh, needs to be maintained. The ABC held an urgent board meeting this afternoon, after which Justin Milne said he intended to stay on as chairman. He's declined an interview, instead saying in a statement that the board has and will continue to govern the corporation independently and ensure its content is of the highest standard. But there are now further questions about Justin Milne's influence. You gotta see this. With claims he put pressure on Triple J not to change the date of its Hottest 100 countdown from Australia Day because of Malcolm Turnbull's reaction. If you haven't got complete independence, it means that any kind of broadcasting or you know any information that's given out to the public is automatically tainted. I would be concerned about the independence of the ABC. So I think it's important that uh, you have a, a good, strong um, news organisation that is um, independent of everything. An independent staff want protected at all costs. Jade McMillan, ABC News.